I've been in Nepal for two full months now, but of course I decided to go see the monkey temples via Mbuna on one of my last days on the morning of a big festival, Gai Jatra. I've been teased by all the mountains surrounding the Kathmandu Valley. And finally, I'm gonna, today I'm gonna do some trekking. Well, very light trekking up to the monkey temple. But I'm excited. I left the afternoon to hopefully get a glimpse of the Kamari, a living goddess who comes out once a year. The morning, however, was all about monkeys. The tourists were surrounded and I couldn't believe just how human-like the monkeys were. I've seen so many monkeys. Walking up took maybe half an hour, but I kept stopping to talk to other travelers and to enjoy the increasingly stunning view over Kathmandu. So many steps. So up I went. I don't know why I decided to climb up at noon on one of the hottest days so far, but sorry, I made it. That's what counts, isn't it? Some other tourists complained about the top being too commercial, but I enjoyed the little souvenir shops along the stupa in the middle. I remember being so happy that day. Traveling alone is one of the best things I've done in my life so far. You meet so many people from all over the world, and I find myself marveling at locals as well as at other travelers. And one piece. It's not bad, is it? It's not bad at all. <laughs> Isn't that just all you want to see? <laughs> The best thing about traveling alone is that everywhere I go, people want to talk to me and achieve it. And this one way up, I've made friends with four different groups. So, how cool is that? I did spend another while just cooing over little baby monkeys. I loved seeing how the locals cared for them, ensuring that they stay around the temples. With the Svayambuna stupa ticked off, I was ready to go join the masses for Gai Jatra. It was late afternoon by the time I got to Dober Square for the festival and I was clearly far too late. People had been queuing since the early morning and I have never seen the center this crowded. Their excitement was infectious and I went deeper and deeper into the crowds while everyone around me danced and enjoyed the day out with the families. So I didn't get to see the Kamari, but I got some ice cream instead. In the end, the day didn't go as planned, but I still had the best time exploring the city. Backpacking means taking each moment as you go and appreciating the day you get instead of the one you expected. And I am A-OK -okay with that. <laughs>